Hey guys, this is just an animated troll here, and welcome back to my commentary series. So the commentary is gonna be Brandon Barney's rant on uh, Sesame Street. Well, I think it's gonna be horrible because he had some valid reasons. So, um, anyways, let's get on with the video in three, two, one, now. Was that the best insult you could come up with? Because that name was just pathetic. And also, the more like terms getting overused nowadays. Even though I do, do some times in my rants. So, let's just continue. Oh my god. This show sucks. Dude, you're supposed to say stinks. Also, correction. This show definitely... Rocks in my opinion. The show is about multicolored muppets, and they like to go on failure adventures. Bruh, the the failure adventures terms are getting overused. Elmo can speak right, just like Big B. He's also a huge crybaby. Well, that was not very nice for saying Elmo's a crybaby. That was not very nice at all. You know that. Oh my goodness, Brandon Barney. That was really rude for what you just said to Elmo. You can't talk back to him like that. That's just too far. Okay, pause right there. Bro, you're supposed to say stupendous. Can you just watch your language? You, your parents gonna hear about this one. Not trying to be mean about that. Cookie Monster is a bad show. Wait, what? Did you just say that? Bro, that's not very nice to say to Cookie Monster. You know that? I think Cookie Monster is not that... F not, yeah, yeah, I know. I think Cookie Monster is a very nice blue character who eats amazing cookies. Not gonna lie, he's my favorite Sesame Street character. And Brendan and Bonnie, that was just rude to say. He always eats cookies for no freaking reason. Dude, it's his own opinion. Also, watch your language. The bird is so dumb. He does not even know how to build a nest. Actually, he does. He does build a nest. Also, how dare you call Big Bird dumb? That's not very nice. He's smart, not dumb. And he has a teddy bear named Razor. What? Razor? No. No one likes Razor Bar. Bruh, that doesn't make any sense. Terrible insult. Like I just said, the more like term is getting overused. This bear sucks. Well, I think the bear is really good in my opinion. He's really adorable. Not gonna lie. I think I know the reason why Oscar Pig is a trash king. Because he is poor and homeless. Okay, I still like Oscar, but you had to, you bro, you had to be rude with him. How, how is he poor and homeless? He, that's his home. He lives in the trash can, bro. Bruh, you, you can't say the I word. That's just rude, dude. You know that? And off that was bad. Oh my god. That is so dumb and annoying. Bruh, how is it dumb and annoying? That's just rude, you know. Also, you, the, oh my what? You're supposed to say, oh my goodness. Right? Right? Hold on a second. Did you just swear? Bro, watch your language. You can't swear like that. He also has a movie called Follow That Bird. Follow That Bird? No. More like Don't Follow That Bird. Well, I still like Follow That Bird, but... 
You don't have to be rude like that, don't you? This movie sucks. Bruh, bruh. Like I've just said before, you're supposed to say stinks. But, um, correction, this movie rocks. Also, Follow the Bird is one of my favorite movies, even though I didn't watch it yet. Even worse, it has another movie called The Adventures of Elmo and Groucho. Well, I think The, El the Adventures of Elmo and Groucho has to be my favorite movie. I just watched it when I was a kid. But now I'm 12 because I just watched it. So, um... Dude, did I just ask? Because it's not worse than Follow That Bird. And now you're just going to be rude of it. Are you? The Adventures of Elmo in Grouch Land? No. More like the Misadventures of Elmo in Felch Land. Bruh. Terrible insult. Like I just said at the start of the video, the more like turns are getting over used this movie is worse than follow that bird dude it's not worse than follow that bird because i like follow that bird adventures of emma and grouchland and you don't have to be rude just like that seriously worst of all it has a so-called play with new sesame bruh it's not worse than the movies but I didn't even watch Play With Me Sesame. Also, why does it have to be on Noggin? Um, I, I just really don't know. <laughs> but, um, I still like Play With Sesame. Even though I just didn't watch it yet. Because I like Play With Sesame a lot, but I didn't watch it as a kid, though. So... Yeah, just make your make up your mind, okay? Now try and be mean, all right? All right? It was me sesame. No, more like poop with me sesame. Yo, that is disgusting, bro. You're gonna get a copyright strike for saying that term. Also, like I just said at the start, the more like terms are getting overused. So that's just a disgusting term I have ever seen in my life. This show is worse than the TV show itself. It's not even worse, okay? But if you like this show, I respect your opinion. I respect your opinion back, but yeah, I respect your opinion term is getting overused, you know? How is the animation that dumb? I think the animation is really smart to me. So annoying. How is the theme song annoying? I liked the theme song when I was a kid, but I'm neutral to I'm neutral to nowadays. So it's part of my childhood because it brings back me Nolagesta. The characters are so annoying. How are the characters so lame? I think the characters are good in my opinion. So can you just deal with it? They like to smoke pot, eat fruit for dinner, drink tea for breakfast, and go to school naked when it is time for their school. That's disgusting! Are you serious? That is the disgusting term I've ever seen in my life. Well... At least I didn't even use that term in my rant videos. So anyways, can you just deal with it, please? At least the show gets canceled. Bro, that's channel first thing. That's getting old, you know. You know who likes this show? Molly. Bro, fictional characters don't have opinions. Because they are not real. Sits on his butt and he 
just going loaded. He's a wild one. He is. Um, actually, he doesn't because he literally didn't even does that. You know? And do you know who hates this show? About everyone on the entire planet. Bruh, not everyone has to despise this show. Every single kid and parent likes this show. Not everyone likes this show, but everyone likes the entire universe. Well, almost everyone, except the user that they despise this show, including you. Except for Skeleton on World X. I respect your opinion. Anyways, they wish they could kill all the cats. Bro, this is getting old. And also, how dare you say that they wish they could kill the cast? Bro, now you're just being rude to talk back. Are you serious? <sighs> Let's just go on. They wish they could kill all what does Shimmer and Shine have to got to be in this rant? Even though I'm neutral to Shimmer and Shine nowadays, but I don't like the um uh, sus moments. Also, thank you TC Fizz for telling me that. But let's just go on to the rant. What does Teletubbies has to got to be in this rant? Even though I like Teletubbies. Or sometimes neutral it nowadays. To all users who hate Teletubbies, to all of you are watching this, I respect your opinion. And the rant. Next rant. Donald D. Or Thank goodness the rant is over. What do I think about this video? This video was horrible because you've said some disgusting things, swearing, bashed opinions, or he didn't, I guess. He did cancel for channel forcing and put fictional characters like in hate spot. But anyways, thanks for watching my commentary. And don't forget to like and subscribe, or somehow, but um, anyways, thanks for watching, and stay tuned for episode 3 of my commentaries. Goodbye, and um, see you tomorrow!